Bullet Train. So let me give you the synopsis of Bullet Train. Brad Pitt stars as Ladybug, an unlucky assassin determined to do his job peacefully after one too many gigs gone off the rails. Fate, however, may have other plans as Ladybug's latest mission puts him on a collision course with leadful adversaries from around the globe, all with connected yet conflicting objectives on the world's fastest train. From the re- director of Deadpool 2, David Leach, the end of the line is only the beginning in a wild non-stop thrill, thrill, wow, if I could say the word thrill, thrill ride through modern day Japan. Now, that synopsis in and of itself is one that we've seen before, an ex-spy who's kind of transitioning through his career, trying out some other things, but the synopsis it wasn't really enough to get me excited, and honestly, even the first trailer wasn't enough to get me excited, but first of all, we've got what my mom calls the hunk of burning love, Brad Pitt starring in it, which is enough for a lot of people to get excited for this movie overall already. When I take a closer look at the cast and crew between Brad Pitt Joey King, Aaron Taylor Johnson, Brian Tyree Henry, Andrew Koji, and Hiroyuki Sonata. That's enough to get me absolutely pumped for this film. When I first saw this trailer for Bullet Train, initially I thought to myself, this movie looks really stupid. To me, it just looked like a jumbled action mess with Brad Pitt doing random things. However, more trailers have come out. I've gotten to see a lot more action. I've gotten to see a lot more of the vibe of what the movie's going for. And it's enough to get me really, really excited. Basically, the spy who thinks he's He's going to be having an easy time with an easy job and a more peaceful one. He's just trying to find his, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? His peaceful end to his career when all of a sudden things just go way off the rails and go really unexpected. I'm excited to see how that's going to turn out. Plus, I'm a huge fan of, like I said, most of the cast I'm familiar with a lot of their work, especially Brad Pitt. Obviously, most people are familiar with his work. I'm a big fan of Brian Tyree Henry, especially since he's risen from the ranks of Atlanta. Aaron Taylor Johnson, I've grown a liking to from the likes of Tenet. Also, Avengers Age of Ultron, I really enjoyed that film. Andrew Koji from uh, G.I. Joe Snake Eyes Origins. I think this month is going to start off with Bullet Train. It's going to debut in theaters August 5th. If you guys love the hunk of burn and love in Brad Pitt, I think you're going to have something to look forward to in this film. Coming up next for the month of August, and actually I think my most anticipated movie of the month is going to be a movie called Emily the Criminal starring Aubrey Plaza. 